Good morning from our sea day on Utopia. Yes, it is morning. Look at how calm the waters are. Because we're not moving, we're not far away. Look at the sky too. Wow. It looks like it's gonna rain. But the water is so slick. It looks like a dream. It is kind of bright out there, so let's close that. Check out El Loco Fresh. Well, here's the ship coin or the ship model. It's not as big as Carnival. But the ship is larger than the Carnival XL class for sure. That's cool. Like I'm not the only one who has this idea. The line starts here. Grab your plate. Got fresh tortillas, pulled pork, beef carnitas, chicken carnitas. Try some other beef. Let's get a chicken burrito. You can make your own nachos. I want to fly. Have a topping bar right there. And I got uh, guacamole and some stuff for my quesadilla burrito, some beef, some uh, rice, and a flan. And they have fruit punch right there, as well as a soda machine. Water. And then a cool bar, cantina. Fresca. This back here also, behind El Loco Fresh on deck 16 is the activities place. You got your basketball court, your zip line, which I'm about to watch somebody do, which is crazy. Cause you're up, I don't know how many stories, that's a lot. And you go over there. And I'm gonna go around and see if I can get on the abyss, the dry side, see if I'm able to do that. The flow rider is way over there. Okay, here we go. Oh, I don't know about that. So you don't have to do anything but let go, just suspend your feet. Wow, I don't think I could do that. Great seating back here. Look at the views. Here's a flow rider, low end. There is a double one, but this is pretty cool. Oh my gosh. So you can't uh, film in it, but it was really quick. It was the quickest way to get down here to deck six. Giving out cotton candy. It's that time, last day, and we get the biggest uh, towel animal today. This is like the Royal Caribbean special. I feel like they all do this. It's usually in two parts, but he, he makes a tight towel animal. Oh, oh no. 
leave him there. Already have the tip out here. I don't need luggage tag. I just realized I got a bottle of Cabernet Savion. Compliments of the Casino Royale. That's when you know you've gambled too much. Yep. Good evening from the last evening on Utopia. It is a beautiful evening. I took a long nap, obviously. Um, it's just something I like to do, and these beds are so comfortable to me. The air, it's nice. It's pretty quiet, except for the children banging on the wall periodically. But I'm gonna go to dinner in the buffet. I have not tried the buffet for, for dinner yet, and then I'm going to the ice skating show, which hopefully Jordan is there. Jordan, the YouTuber. That's my plans for this evening on board Utopia. The last day. It's already been, it's like that. Blink of an eye. Look at what they have for the last night here. Just some of the desserts. A little dessert plate set up. And they're still doing the ice sculptures, which I love. They might reuse them. I think that's supposed to be spinning, but it's not. Chocolate sculpture. So they have crab claws back. Let's try some. You guys have started, got up and started dancing for the windtimer people. So it's taste of Indian night, but they had shrimp and they had some crab claws in their, I think dungeon is. I got some naan bread, a vegetarian roti wrap, some onion, cucumber, tomato salad. There's a lot going on in there. It looks really good. Last windjammer buffet. It's over. Get here early because this is 15 minutes prior to the 8 p.m. start time and it is pretty packed. At least it's nice and cool. Join us as we journey to Utopia.
So here is Studio B. I had to wait till it cleared out, but it's totally empty. There you go. Well, the ice skating show Utopia with the YOU in Studio B on board Utopia of the Seas. It was amazing. And you got to see Jordan Both. I think is how you say her name. I hope. But she has a YouTube channel and she's a professional figure skater. And she does contracts and works with Royal Caribbean. You never know who you're going to meet. And she's pretty famous on YouTube. Plus, you know, she's also real famous for being a, a ice skater professional figure skater wow it was really entertaining this is the last night though and get there super early i was there 15 minutes early and it was full i had to sit in probably the worst seats but at least i had a seat some people were standing up only so keep that in mind i get there super early that show because of the venue it's so small you might want to get there 25 to 30 minutes early actually it's 30 minutes because same thing for the aqua show aqua show was still probably my favorite show just because there were so many people i'm shocked by the amount of entertainers they have on this ship but i guess they have to because of how big the ship and how many guests there are but the the aqua show i didn't even count how many people were involved in that and i know in the production show i counted at least 26 different entertainment people six singers and 20 dancers that's a lot of people on the stage but i highly recommend the utopia and the shows and this is my last night i don't know what this video is going to look like because there's not much to film for this kind of sea day I, I just rested most of the day but i got a pack and it's a long day tomorrow of travel. Thank you for joining me on this Utopia cruise. I hope wherever you are, you look into cruising. Reach out to me if you're interested in booking a cruise or have any questions. You can find my email down below or you can reach out to me on social media and message me. See you on the seas and happy cruising, everybody. Bye-bye. morning breakfast here yeah, right on the back of the windjammer get a good view of the back of the smokestacks i am literally the first person off the ship i wasn't the first person on but i'm the first person off everybody else is eating Ooh, star of the seas Sunrise over Melbourne, waiting to get a rental car here. There's the SpaceX launch right there.